Hi everybody, this is Tim with TD Sports Cards. Uh, today we're going to change it up. I usually open up baseball, but I'm going to do a 1989 Topps uh, football. This set is uh, has a lot of Hall of Fame rookies in it. Um, you're looking at the main ones are Thurman Thomas, Chris Carter, Tim Brown, Rod Woodson, Michael Irvin. Um, some other notable names are Sterling Sharp, Steve Wisenowski, uh, Chris Spielman, John Taylor, uh, Jay Novacek. But then you're, you're also looking for the Rice, Montana, um, some of the other good Hall of Fame um, players. And we're looking for tens. So we're looking. So in, in the end, we're looking to get a uh, oh. A couple good shots at some of the some of the rookies, let alone uh, a couple shots at some of the big names that are in this. Uh, and then obviously uh, Barry Sanders, Dion Aikman, those are in the in the traded set of this. So it's it's uh, they won't you won't be seeing them in, seeing them in, in here. But let's rip into it. Just got this in. Um, so you can see it looks the corners on the pack except for that one. But typically the corners all look pretty good. So that helps. Even the bottom ones, corners look good. You don't see a lot of the whiting. You don't see a lot of the whiting and everything. So um, got good confidence that these are be in good shape. There's always a couple of packs that are smug get munch, and then obviously during this time, there is a uh, the quality control just wasn't wasn't that that good, wasn't peachy king at all. Alrighty, so we're gonna make our gonna make our stacks, and uh, as we go. Now I'm gonna top load the the good ones uh, probably as we go and uh, go from there. So these have 36 packs. All right, as you can see, it's got the gum. Gum looks like in good shape, but you can see the back of the card because of the moisture, heat, whatever. This kills the card. So Tim McIver, McIver, uh, and you can even see the front of it a little bit. Uh, try to get the right. There we go. And that's through the front of it. <laughs> Crazy. So I'll say every so every last card will go in the, the the trash, and I don't keep those ones that are like horribly toasted. They have no shot at anything. You know, Ken O'Brien, remember him? Stubbs. All right, and you got league leaders in this. This one's uh, scoring leaders. So I'll go and insert Lionel Manual. And this one has a little bit of a gloss to it, so it's a pretty sharp looking card. Runs over Hill, Elroy. Kelly reads offense. Jim Kelly was big back then. Four Super Bowls, but no wins. Chris Good. My Lions. <sighs> Don't know what to say about that. Steve Burline. See, and that one's even got, because that was the second to last one, so that one even got ruined with the stain. So I won't I don't like keeping those. I just get them out of my boxes from the get-go. Don't even think twice about it. So, there's the gum. Jacob Green. Sorry, I didn't bleed through that much on this one. And this one had a little bit of wax stain on it. Marion Barber. Like I said, I just get rid of those. Because no one's going to want those. Ah, here's a good one. 
Good back during that during the time, Mr. Kurt Warner. Very nice. Bruce Matthews. He's a Hall of Fame. Here come Mark Clayton. Clayton during the Miami Miami days. Clayton was part of Marino. There he goes. Sanders changes pace. Neil Anderson. Yep. All right. Like Tom Zack. Sorry, Bears. Urban Mays. Stanley Morgan. Carl Banks. It's a good one. Uh, it's got a little machine print imprint right there. You can see it. So that's a bummer. Boomer Esiason. Ruben Rodriguez. Actually, I remember that guy. Larry Roberts. Greg Townsend. Defensive end. All right, let's see what else we got. Like I said, there's hopefully one of the big ones, which I figure one of them is probably going to be. All right. Going to be ones that's going to be stained. Neil Lomax. There we go. Michael Irvin. This one looks pretty dang close to a 10. No surface issues. That one has a good shot at a 10. So that one we're going to go right to the top loader. If I can get it in the sleeve without messing up the other corner. There we go. So that's a good one. Michael Irvin. It's even like that, it's, it's pretty centered. Yeah, that one has a good shot at a 10. Which, 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 which pay would pay for this box if it did. Randall Cunningham's another good one. Jackie Slater, Hall of Fame. Hofer. Swain. I like this, this box. They're pretty darn near centered. Mark Clayton insert. Coffer. There's Boz. Big Bosworth. He was the one that could have, should have, would have, and steroids, drugs, everything else. What's your slaughter? He was actually a good receiver back then. Izzy Colt. And he ended up eventually going to um I think. Do you stay with the Vikings? I'm thinking he went to the Rams. Uh, Page, Tony Eason. Another woulda, coulda, shoulda. Just was a he was a 500 quarterback, I think at best. A couple decent seasons, a couple horrible seasons. All right, so that one's gone. And Anthony Tooney. Tony was a good player. All right. Oh, there we go. On the inside. Nice. Joe Montana. Uh, just a hair shifted. So this one looks like it's going to be in like a nine. But nine still would go probably go for about 20, 25 bucks. So one of those you keep and... When you decide to send them in, they're there. Sewell, Brown, Mac, another one, Ronnie Lott. Love my Ronnie. He's one of my PC guys. Sam Mills, Eddie Brown, Ron Rivera. Yep, that's Coach. Bruce Hill. Reggie Williams, Ronnie Holman, Scott Norwood. He actually should be in the Hall of Fame. Record breaker, Tim Brown. This one looks a little bit off top to bottom, a little bit left to right. So this one you're looking at probably like a, 
a nine, eight at worst. Wow. There we go. But that's his rookie season. So even at a nine, it's worth something. And Jim Burt. All right. Let's rock on. Yeah, this is before the the Dallas train came. And they just kept raking every year, Lee Williams. All right. See what else we got. Art Monk. Awesome receiver. I like these are centered. Corona. Great running back. Rink Minifield. Mm, I can't remember if, if he's in the hall. Delore. Gary Clark. Steve Jordan was good back then. John Stevens. See these and these look like they're more off center than than the other ones. But and the regular. Go Freilich. I know I'm going to pass some of these guys that are Hall of Famers. Eddie Brown. Deron Cherry. He was a hard hitter. Um, I remember him. He was such a hard hitter. It was back when KC had the, the, the crazy defense. Alright, so we're going to get rid of... Ricky McReynolds and DJ Dozier. Dozier had a brother. All right. It's Anthony Carter. That one looks like in great shape. See that year we had we had um some good good receivers came out. I mean, just think of it. Besides Bo coming on the scene, you had Thurman, you had Chris Carter, Irvin, Sterling Sharp, Novacek as a tight end. I mean, it was... And Tim Brown's a legend. Irvin's won a bunch of championships. Chris Carter is one that everybody wanted to play with. Anthony Carter. Moyer, Sko, Paris, there he is, there's a Novacek, there are the Colonels, before we went to, he's more known for is the good old Dallas, Dallas, one of the all-time receivers, the card looks just a hair left to right, that's probably like a nine, get reasons, Mike Haynes. Mike Haynes was good. He was fast. Jim Booty. John Elliott. Alright. Got a Hall of Famer. That's Kevin Green. He's gone. And Kelvin Bryant. Alright. Right off the bat, we got Roy, Roy Green. Bruce Hill, Scott Case, Wilbur Marshall, he was a beast, Fletcher Adams, Neil Anderson, Kevin Mack, he was another big boy, I remember Kevin Mack, Christian Okoye, you just didn't want to go up against those guys, there we go, Rod Woodson, that one looks just tad left and right, so that's, that's probably a, a solid nine. So that's a good one. There we go. We got the Novacek. Brown. Urban. Okay. All right. Childress. Edmonds. Turner. Hanford. Yep. Yeah, 89 is a year that I was watching sports left and right. Bo was my guy. Barry was Barry was is was was the god. Go Kevin Green, awesome. 
See, so Ernest Givens. See, a lot of these are just look at them, they're centered. So, this is a good box. Obviously, the boxes will vary because then you got some that are off centered like crazy. But that bar, there's Vinny Givens, Andre Bruce, super rookie. John Meads, Kent Hall, it's his rookie, I believe. And then Ray Green. Alright. Gary Reasons is gone. Oh, what a bummer. Eric Dickerson. And it's got the gum crypt on it. <laughs> That's a bummer. Oh, got a Jerry Rice coming up. Kevin Mack. John Stevens. Riddick. Altoon. Edmonds. Lowry. We got a Rice. Rice with my guy. Rice, Barry, and LA. Marcus Allen. It's a good one. Just offset. So Fletcher. Hampton. There we go. Jim Kelly. Uh, it's got a little bit of a stainish. Ah. Bummer. There's Flutie. Yeah, it passed around, but it's a Flutie. Alright, one stack down. Okay, bye bye, Chip. And bye bye, Ron Johnson. And Boomer's got a stain on it that bleed it over. Yep. Sorry, Boomer. Like I said, I don't even, I don't even worry about them because that way when I'm going through them, I don't got to worry about uh, if they got any major issues. Ooh, there we go. This one looks pretty centered. Except for maybe top to bottom a little bit. I don't know. But LT. Gotta love LT. Best defense player ever. Even though he was on Coke, he was a crazy madman. Changed the game during the time. Mike Haynes, Max Montoya, more Ricky Reynolds, Wesley Welker, Pinkett, and Minifield. Oh, this one was a machine. Snafu. Got a double. Oh, like Singletary. With the stain. That's a bummer. Richard Dent. Ugh. Hate to throw away the, the good guys, but it is what it is. Herschel Walker. Awesome. Yeah, USFL. He was he was awesome. Anthony Miller. He's one of the top tight ends ever for Chargers. True Hill. Jim Henson. Steve Jordan. Mark Jackson. Actually, I liked Mark Jackson. I was a Tecmo Bowl. Tecmo Bowl, he had some speed, so it was kind of funny to try to break one loose with him. Thomas Sanders. Yep, yep. I had another double one. So it must have been sticking. Pat Swelling again. Gary Anderson. Keith Woodside. Oof. I meant there. I thought that was Wood Rod Woodson. Alright. Michael Carter. Part of the beast of that front. Lard. Tim Brown record breaker. Nice looking. Yeah. Rookie seasons. Tim Brown, Randy Moss they had huge rookie seasons. Reggie. Altoon. Alan Binkett, Billy Ray. There we go. Another Irvin. This one looks good too. 
Probably I can rub it off top to bottom. But so that one probably looks like a nine. And you'll see as I send these in that you'll see them come back because I'll send them and I'll end up sending them in. Bestie Jackson and Wim Fuller. Even if I get nines on them, I'm fine with it. At worst, it's a long term long term hold, but some of these are seventy, eighty dollars. So even if I try to grade them for what the new grading price is, Mike Wilcher, um, and get them back, they're still you know I still sell them for twenty, but try to build up some of my tens. Some of my tens will go, especially if I, like I said, if by chance I start getting duplicates of stuff. Eric McMillan, he was good. Henry Ellard, this would be Hall of Fame. Harris, Morlas, he was he was good. Yeah, no print, print error. That pack was less to be desired. Izzy Colt's gone, and we got Ray Donaldson. It's Andre Reed. Reed was solid. Oh, there's Marino. It's Henry Ellard. Andrew Williams, Harmon, Checklist, Hobart, Hinton, Andre Reed. I liked Andre Reed. There's a Dan the Man. Really off center. This one's probably like an eight. So this, this cardstock is so a hair thicker. Just wants to play. But any damn the man's. It's like some of these other ones are. Uh, you just you just keep them. Brooks, Barber, Brown, or All right. Find Baker, and we got the Bears. All right, let's get to the good stuff. There we go, Ricky Sanders. So these have a coating on them, so it's Lions. Probably end up sending in the best one I got out of those. Cobb, Stanley, Cart Cotton, Strensrow, Strensrud. Brennan, Eddie Brown, James, Charles Mann, Rathman. Rathman was awesome. Wade Wilson. Wilson was, oh, I'd give him about a B to B minus quarterback. He still produced. He's, he's one of those 9 7 kind of quarterbacks. Ricky Jackson, that one. That one blood all over. And Chris Goad. All right, what do we got here? Icky Woods. Come on, do the Icky Shuffle. That was big. Dan Majakowski. Oh, that's his rookie. Oh, second. Bills. Got a Ree. Or a Kelly. Conway. Tate. Grant. Or Anthony Carter. John Kidd, no relation to Jason Kidd, Pat Leahy, Scow, Mark Collins, Cornelius Bennett. Put that over there. I'll take another look at that one. Yeah, Buffalo defense, Frisco defense. Those were the, the Bears defense. Those are the solids. Bye bye, Eric Moore. And Carl. Those are some of the, the best defenses in. And I know I'm forgetting some other ones. Uh, you have uh, New Orleans. By far. Yep. Got a Woodson signing. Sliding. Eric Dickerson. It's 
Kozar, Walter, Sean Jones, Via, Sagahima, Doug Williams, Craig Bell, and the Woodson rookie again. So I've gotten two and two stacks. So you're looking at, I don't know, maybe three a card out of these. So we'll see. Duncan, Anthony Munoz, easy Hall of Fame. He was he was dominant during the time. There we go. That bar. Good. Thurman Thomas. This one was a hair off. So this one looks like about a nine. Vernon Thurman. He was like a uh, example. He was what Kareem Hunt did his rookie season. And Thurman did it for what, five years, six years. Caught out of the backfield, ran the ball. Yeah, Thurman was awesome during that time. Scott Dill. All right, got Aaron Cox. Packet zeroes in. Hilliard, Jennings, Record Breaker, Marino. This one's really off center. This is probably like an eight. Oh my gosh, these sleeves I'm just having a little bit of issue with today. Dan Hampton, he was a beast. Got a stain on it. Rick Martin, Dejas. Oh, yeah. Even there, he looks old, but he was old. Not that old. Uh, at this point, he was 60 and it was 84. Supplemental draft. Is that a Mexico? 60, yeah, uh, almost 40. All right, Bruce. There you go. Chris Spielman, super rookie. This one looks pretty good. A little bit of. See that down there, but one of those that probably eight nine. Oh my gosh! Oh, he's going there. Oh my gosh! Can't believe I'm having so many problems with. It. I don't know if it's this batch or if it's me. LA, there's my boy, Steve McMichael. So, uh, Dennis McKinnon. All right. So we got through two stacks, half a box. A couple Urbans, a couple of Woodsons, a Thurman. All right. When I haven't seen is the Chris Carter. All right, Neil Anderson, John Settle, Harris, Harris, Hand, Hopkins, Reggie. Ernie Harman, Mark Collins, Vance Jackson, Steven, that's like a third one I am, Riddick, Duncan, Domas, that pack was horrible. I don't think I've seen a rice either yet. Eddie Brown, bye. And the Boomer, that's two Boomers. Yep. Speak of the devil. Jerry Rice, really off center. And. Uh, 
looks like gum or, gum or wax on it. Mm, right. I'll see if I can't rub that off because it's got a it's got a, a surface is like a, it's not like a regular card. So we'll see. See if I can't get it off. Not. I'll, I'll have to go. Warren Moon. I was nicely centered. Kid. Breach. Oh, her. Chris Hinton. Reed. Donald Sands. And uh, Brennan. All right. First race, and, and it's marked up. What a bummer. All right. There's John Kidd. James Howland. All right, it's Woodside. It's Rippin, super rookie. Yeah, Rippin's in that batch. There's Herschel. It's Herschel. Man, it was a beast. Wade Wilson. Grant. Anthony Carter. Quite from the Dolphins out of Rivera Beach, Florida. All right, let's see who else we got here. Greta Manuel. John Stevens. Carmen, Gentry, and Tenley. Hey, this pack isn't looking too good. Cornelius Bennett, but really off center. Ricky Jackson. Ricky Jackson was actually really good. There we go. Two best looking cards out of the batch. One of them is the one we want. Good deal. Off left to right, top to right. Yeah. You're looking. That's probably like an eight or nine. Nines are like fine wine. They just keep getting better. Oh, there's a Spielman rookie. Stained. Pretty centered too, but gotta go. Willie Galt, Olympian, one of the fastest guys in the NFL for a long time. Michael Carter, the Tim Brown again, who with a dinked corner by chance. Ouch. That one's not good. Oh. Uh, I'll decide on that one later. Sometimes they're really like that bad. I'll just get rid of them. That or put in my junk box. There we go. Thurman. So now look at that. That one slid in nice and easy. And Dejas and Bruce. Yep, 88, 89 were good years. Had so much stuff, even 90. So much, so many good players came out in different sports. Now they cold. Jamie Morris was a good, decent back back then. There we go. Bobo. Bobo. Gotta love the Bobo. Bo knows. 
Uh, left up to bottom, left to right, and it's probably a nine. Pretty solid looking though. All right, Mecklenburg. Now I've played Tecmo Bowl. Played the Broncos. I didn't because I always had Elway. Mecklenburg has a shaky tackle. He'll shake you, and when he tackles you, as he would, and he would just bowl through some people, and play Mecklenburg, and and you'll see what I mean. It's it's it was pretty crazy. I picked him a lot when I was on defense. Chris Chandler, there's Ozzy, old Ozzy, ducked around for a long time. Yep, Ozzy Novacek, uh, what was it? I think Christensen. Um, I don't know, I'm missing some other people. So there was an early batch of tight ends compared to compared to now with and you have Gronk, Kelsey. It was a different different game back then. Henry Ellard. That one might have like a little imprint, like a machine. Classic. Ugh. Dan, Dan the man. Brooks, Barber, Browner, there's Gil Flutie, Stratford, Fulcher, Gary Plummer. Plummer was pretty solid back then. Max Montoya, Ed Tutal Jones. Yeah, you gotta love some Tutal. He was a uh, oh, there's a documentary on on them, and and they talk about him. But yep, yeah, Tutal. It was kind of funny. I think it's he was taller than everybody on one team, if I remember right. Was, no one, no one else was taller than him. He was what six nine. He was a big boy. Marcus Cotton. Stanley's got stain. Unless they're like big, I won't even think about it. Goad, Bobby he Hebert, Overdahl, Ricky Sanders, like I say he's pretty good back. As you can see, 1,000 yard club. I think he did a couple years. Pinkett, McDaniel, Chip Low Miller. Uh, I remember him. Good and bad. Mark Jackson. And Schweebs. Yeah, but Lil Miller stayed around for a long time. Dusty Jackson and David Tate. Alright, let's see what we got. Over some more rooks. Where are they at? Lansford, he was there for a long time. Galloway, Greg Bell. It's pretty solid back then. JoJo, Thomas Sanders, Mike Singletary. One of the top ones of all time. He was a beast. Like I said, it was Singletary. It was, everybody said it was his, his eyes. All right. Three quarters of the way through, everybody. If you're still with me, thank you for bearing. But. I just thought this would be a fun product to rip. Jim Everett, first one we got of that. That one's that one's got the, the casket gum. Um, thought this would rip. This was during my time, so it was. Uh, there's Mark Bavaro. There's another one I forgot. Actually, what's funny is there's a 
uh, where I live. His cousin lives, and he comes down to visit a few times a year. He told me. So, but yep, interesting story on that one. Roger Craig was good. There's Allard and Tune. Yeah. Palmer, Joe Morris, another Bam Morris, Perriman, Mike Rozier, Crumtree, Jojo, Pepper Jansen. He was he was another good one. All right. Who have I not got? It's Chris Carter. Got a Nova check. Haven't seen Sterling Sharp yet either. Oh, this one has to go because of stain. But Christian Okoye, man, 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 he was a beast. He had him and he had Barry Ward coming at you, both big guys. It's like, which one do you want to? And Okoye was just like Bo Jackson. He'll run right over you and, and through you. There you go. Before the passing, the crazy passing times, Steve Largent was one of the top all-time receivers. Now he's probably not even in the in the top twenty or top ten, maybe top fifteen all-time. Because but he was highly respected for a lot of years. I mean, even when you look at the numbers. The time they didn't really pass, he was still getting 70, 70 plus passes, 1,000 yard seasons. Look at the TDs. Uh, during a time when they really didn't, didn't pass much, he was getting it done. Patrick Craig, Albert Lewis, he was another one like Steve Atwater. Steve Atwater was one of my, one of my favorite guys, uh, but Albert Lewis was a beast too. Or take your block off. Marcus Allen, Gary Anderson, Mark Kelso. All right, we're getting down, everybody. Let's see if we can't pull away a couple more of the the main rooks. Still haven't pulled a, a rice yet. Got a couple merinos. Got a bow. Got a Montana, but can pull the rice. Actually, I got one rice, but it's one that's not good. All right, let's see what we got. Boomer Wade Wilson. There you go. Doug Williams on the phone to his agent going, Look, life matters. Marino, Henry Allard, Stop Mitchell, Bernie. Millen, stack case. Doug Williams is a good quarterback. Very underrated. Didn't get much of a chance, and when he did, he, he won. This didn't get much of a chance. This guy here stuck around for a long time. He could pass. Just didn't play with good teams back then. Kurt Warner, Tooney, Vaughn Johnson, Hackett, there's a Randall, uh, Prince and Smear. Other than that, the card is pretty darn. There was one over here, too. Other than that, the card is pretty darn good. Jackie Slater, Hall of Fame lineman, Dolman, Donnelly, there we go. Rice is my boy. Card looks clean. Yeah. Well centered. He was pretty solid back then, too. He was good. See? Record breaker. What do you record break? 
Batista NFL record 19-8 by completing the season with 12,686 yards receiving in his career. He has NFL record 791 receptions. The former st standard of 12,146 yards receiving established by Charlie Joyner from 69 to 86. Like I said, he was, he was one that was, uh, during his time, he was the best. And then Rice came. Actually, probably second best, because then, then Rice came. And then we know what's up with Rice. Rice just demolished everything. There we go. Ah, oh, it's got bad stain. Ronnie Lott. He was a he was a monster. Yeah, by Ronnie. He was definitely a monster. Yep, there's a JoJo. Joe Montana. Broadway Joe, Eric Thomas, Bubby, There's another one that was like a little over 500 quarterback, Van Morris again, Carrier, Burroughs, Manley, Buccaneers, looking for Brady to do it this year, alright guys, got four packs left, you still there with me? We're getting there. I'll do a quick recap. Jim McMahon pitching the ball. Bye bye. Ah, there it is. Got the rookie card stained. Ain't that a pooper? The only one in here that we found, and it had to be stained. What a bummer. Art Monk. Warner. Bruce Smith. Roger Vick. Uh, no relation to Michael Vick, I don't think. Wilbur. Gary Anderson. He was he was good back then. Greg Hayward. Greg Ironhood Ironhead Hayward. Yep, he would go right at he would go right at you. Just not even there was more smash mouth back then. It's come the linebackers had to hit harder because he had backs that were bigger than, or almost as big as some of the linemen. Had two tall's got to go. Like I said, it's a different game. Now it's more speed. You have strength, but there's more speed. It's like in basketball, you go to a smaller lineup. Uh, Bob Paris, Dadford Noonan. Hector Booty. Oof, that one's got a stain on it. Donaldson, there we go. There's a Sterling. Way off center, but let's be lucky to get an eight. There we go. Alright. Jones, Lonzo Hill, Hilliard, Gruber, Doug Smith. Yeah, these last few packs are must be the end of another sheet. That's why I got looking at we're getting new cards. Tom Newberry, Gilbide, and then we got like I said the the Chris Carter one that can't use. Riggs, there's Howie, Newsom, Seth Joyner was pretty good, Tony Dorsett, you gotta watch the history on Dorsett, yeah, so this, these last little bit must have been uh, from another sheet or, or something, because these are all cards that we're not, we didn't get the whole rest of the box, Phil Sims, 
Berline, Marianne, Sam Jones, Clayton was good, John o. Williams. Alrighty. Danny Elder. And another Spielman rookie. That's two of them I think I had to toss. Alright. Got Bruce Hill. Terrace Williams. Walk more. Steve DeBerg. There's another one that had a few decent years. Sean Brown. Tom Zack. Uh, we won't go there. Bentley. There you go. Super rookie. Icky. Coffer. There's a Bosworth. Dickerson record breaker. And Chris Miller. All right. So we'll do the quick recap. Besides the ones that are in this stack, the ones that I pulled out was uh, got, got the Montana. Ed too tall looks pretty good. Got a bow. Got a merino. Record breaker. Got two of these. They almost look like the same cut almost. Got Anthony Carter. Oh, there's another Joe. Forgot about that one. And got a Bryce All Pro. Which looks pretty legitly good. That one has a shot, a good shot of. 10. Um, so those are some of the highlights. Now we go to some of the rookies. Uh, I think we only got two of these. Yep. Yeah. We got two Thermans. This one left to right. That one's left to right. So these are probably nines at best. A Tim Brown record breaker. That one looks like a sh good shot out of 10. That one's centered all the way around. Maybe it's a hair top to bottom. Got a, I know I only got one LT. Oh, there's another Tim Brown. One Nova check. All right, we got Sterling that's way off center. Eight at best. Uh, Rod Woodson. That one's got like a look at that. Might have a little stain right there. Um, I'm just off top to bottom. Top to bottom. Yeah. So, looking at mainly nines on a majority of these. So, there's only a, a good handful of these that are, have a sh good shot at 10. Um, hmm. I like to say this one's more centered. Both these look pretty good though. The fat one's got a little soft corner. So this one would be the one that I'll take a shot at. But, alright, it's your base. These are the regulars. Um, like I said, the one Jerry Rice one that I kind of half wanted was, I don't even know if that will work. I got a fine claw. Or if it was, uh, just a bad print. Let's see if I got any of it. Nope. So, as you can see, it's... That's not coming off, so that was a bad finish on the card. These are glossy. So that one's going to have to go bye-bye. Uh, yeah, here's a Tim Brown that's munched. There on the side, that one's going to have to go bye-bye. Carl Banks has an imprint. Right there. That kind of that happened during that time. Alert stuck, but still good. And sounds fine. Yep, so Carl Banks have to go. I like saving those ones with the especially when they're not definitely not tens. 
But thank you all for, for watching. I think we got some good ones in this, out of this Bass show. Got a bunch of nines. Well worth it in the box. You just got to be picky on the ones you send in and make sure you get at least nines on. Because the nines you can get 20, 25 out of, and then you're, then you're doing good. There's a, there's a bunch of nines in here. A few shots at a 10. Like that one. Mm, I don't know. I don't know if that one will go. That one definitely. That one's a blazer. Anthony Carter. Those are nines. Nine. Bows off center. Too tall. That one's a nine. Hmm. Nines. Snow. That one's got a good shot. That one actually does have a good shot. And we get a bunch of nines, but these look like ten possibilities. The LT. Novacek. This Irvin. This Rice. That Rice one's a blazer. Um, and uh, Mr. Timmy Brown. Maybe. It depends on if that slides by probably that one might just be a good nine. But anyways. You see what it what happened, what we got, what to expect. Uh we will see you guys later. Please feel free to uh like, comment, subscribe. Like I said, I'll have more boxes coming out. Thank you.